What's up with the YouTube Legit Sully? Back at you with another video. And today is release day. Man, I ain't did a release day vlog in a long time, man. We finna go pick up these Al Jordan 3 UNCs and yeah, man, it, 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 it ain't looking too good, man, because sneakers sold out quick. You know, I didn't even go for sneakers done this morning, you know, because I already knew I was gonna come in the mall and pick them up. And yeah, sneakers sold out quick. So prices shot up quick on these things, man. You know, prices shot up quick. So, hey man, hopefully everybody ain't finna run up here, you know, and try to get them because I'm trying to get my pair, man. I'm trying to get my pair. So I'm right now I'm at the Tacoma Mall, man. And we gonna get in here and we gonna see if people are already lined up because it is supposed to be first come, first serve. Man, you know, people in here, but it ain't it ain't bad as I thought it was gonna be, you know. So maybe maybe we maybe we in good hands, you know. Finish line supposed to be getting them. Foot locker supposed to be getting them and Sheik supposed to be getting them. So it's about what? About seven, eight people inside the foot locker line. It's about four or five people inside the um finish line line. That's it's kinda of funny to say finish line line, but <laughs> Yeah, man, we finna walk around here to Sheik to see how many people they got in their line. Because Sheik normally open up at 9 o'clock and they, they sell their pairs, you know. All the pairs they had left over that wasn't claimed for reservations. Because Sheik was the only store that did do the reservations. So, nobody's in line over here. So, hey, man, we gonna probably, we gonna probably just wait around over here and see. If we can get our pair, man. Yes, sir. Let's go, baby. Let's go. She came through for your boy, man. I, I really rock with them over there at Sheik, man. They always look out for me because it was a few pairs that wasn't claimed on reservation. And I was able to get my size, man. So, hey, man. We finna um, see if we can snag a few more pairs. Hey, now it's time to... Uh-huh. Yep. Now it's time to go ahead and get on up out of here or try to see what else we can grab. So, yeah, man, let's go. Man, what's up, man? Yeah, so your boy had some success here, man. We was able to get a couple more pairs. So, hey, I will have some extra pairs. So if y'all interested, go hit me up on IG. You know, everything will be posted on IG. But... Yeah, we gotta get to this other mall, man, because uh, I just got word that they got some pairs there too. So, yeah, man, we gonna check it out. We gonna see if we can hit something else. Man, this first come first serve ain't no joke, man. Boys is not playing. People are lined up and all the stores inside this first mall and sold out. Foot Locker, Finish Line, they both sold out, man. You know, the lines were super long and people was here picking up their pairs, man. See, that's the thing, man. People thought that these was gonna sit, man. With this thing being close to a PE, y'all should have known it wasn't gonna sit, man. What y'all think, you know, about today's release, man? Put it in the comments below. Let me know, man, because I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. I'm not shocked at all because I know that this is a fire colorway and I figured these was gonna sell out, you know. Prices that shot up on these things, prices are almost to like 300 bucks, you know, on, on StockX and, you know, I seen a lot of people out there doing pre-orders for like 250, 265 and, and stuff like that. So, if y'all was able to do pre-orders for those guys that was doing 250, 260, y'all, you know, y'all got a, a steal, man, because if you didn't do a pre-order and you really want the shoe and you missed out for retail, you got to wind up paying almost 300 bucks for your shoe. So pre-orders is not always a bad thing. 
you win some and you lose some, you know. But, hey, man, we're going to keep going and try to get to this mall, man, before they sell out over here. So I got to try to drive fast as I can without getting a ticket. So let's go. Oh, man, yeah, I am back at the house, man. They did a lot of ripping and running, you know, picking up shoes, and I was able to secure my personal pair. Now, this release went crazy, man. These things sold out quick. Like I was telling y'all earlier, they sold out on sneakers. Um, all the stores are pretty much sold out in my area, and all the big sizes went first. All the big sizes went first, man, and it's pretty crazy, so... Let's go ahead and jump straight into the review of the shoe. You know what? I take that back. Before we get into the review, I just want to show y'all a couple dope pieces I picked up last week when I went to um, Sneaker Con in Vancouver. You know, I did a little vlog in there, but um, my, my footage got messed up, so I wasn't able to post my video. You know, I, I was kind of upset because I wanted to put out my video for um, Sneaker Con Vancouver, but my footage got messed up, so I couldn't even, you know, load the video up. But I did cop a few um, items from um, Sneaker Con Vancouver, so I just want y'all, I was gonna make a video about it, but I didn't wanna do a whole, uh, a whole video, uh, one whole video just for the couple items that I picked up. I said I was gonna throw it into my next video. So here it is right here. Your boy picked up the prolific, T from from eight and nine. Let me go ahead and get this open. I have to get this out the pack. You know, shout out to eight and nine. You know they 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 hooked your boy up and gave me this nice little dope little long sleeve T. You know on the back. You know it says prolific, hard work, patience, dedication. Man, you know this is pretty dope, man. Shout out to Nipsey Hussle, man. R.I.P. man. Dude was really talented, man. And here we go. Another thing we got. I picked up this hoodie that I thought was fire, man. This thing here was super dope. I thought this thing was super dope. This right here was a Sneaker Con exclusive. These are real limited, so they only had them at Sneaker Con in Vancouver. And it says resellers open 24-7. And it got like an Air Jordan 1 on the front. It says sell by trade. And this thing here is dope, man. And on the side, you know, it says 89 Manufacturer um, Co. And right here on this sleeve, it says Sneaker Con, man. Just a couple dope things. And one more thing before we get to the, um, the shoes, man. Here we go right here, man. I got the 8 and the 9, you know, jeans with the... Uh, 89 little Brandon right here. Now these are real dope because these remind me of Jabos back in the day, man. They say that's where they got their inspiration from, the Jabos. And I, I love rocking the Jabos when, um, uh, when I was younger. And man, this just bring back memories for me. So I had to go on and cop these. Man, but what do y'all think about my pickups? Y'all think they dope, man? But anyway, enough of all that. Let's go ahead and jump straight into the review. Ah, yeah, here we go, man. Ooh, y'all see it, man. We got this dope Air Jordan 3 box, man. I'm pretty sure you've seen videos. You know, you got the UNC um, um, pull-off top on the box. And this is just this a real nice touch to the box. Let's go ahead and get right into the size um, label. It says Air Jordan 3 Retro White Valor Blue Tech Gray Size 11 and a half personal pair and retail on these things was hundred and ninety dollars so let's take the lid off as you can see the lid you got this little on um, unc blue on the top with red on on the inside and you got your little little cement print paper uh, i'm not sure if it's picking it up you can't really see it and let's go ahead and get um both of the shoes out the box bam voila here we go man these things are nasty man these things are nasty let's go ahead and jump straight into the shoe bah 
right, here we go, man. Y'all know how we like to do it. We're going to go ahead and start at the bottom. Bam, you know, you got your UNC um, pod right here. You got your Navy um, um, pod at the back with your white Jordan going down. You got your tech gray outsole at the bottom. Moving up to the um, midsole, you got your white midsole wrapped around the um, shoe. At the back, you got your UNC wrapped around. This shoe was constructed pretty good, man. The, the leather on this thing is, is super... Super tumble, man. These are these are dope, man. Let's keep it on. Move along to the upper. You got your all white upper going wrapped all the way around the shoe. And as you can see, you got your cement, um, your elephant print, um, and your cement mint, mint colorway. And then also at the back, you got your Nike. I mean, not Nike Air. I'm I'm, I'm so used to saying Nike Air. You got your Air, your Jumpman with your Air logo at the back on the on uh, pull tab back here. Oh, there's nothing at the on um, back of there. Let's keep going. Uh, right here on your on your eyelets, you got on um, navy color right here, and you got the UNC color right here for your on um, your on um, your lace eyelets, and then up here you got the navy colorway. Uh, let's keep going. You know. Behind the tongue, you got this UN, uh, not UNC, I keep wanting to say UNC. You got this navy colorway behind the tongue, and it says heart upside down. And also, you got your jump man, your UNC jump man outlined in the navy blue. And you can see the butt crack right here on the jump man. It's pretty funny because a lot, all, of, all of them is coming with the, um, all of them is coming with the with the butt crack now. It, it's crazy, but that's back in the day. That's how that's how the fakes used to be. But uh, it, it's funny that that the uh, factories are pushing them out like that. And on the inside of the shoe, it says this 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 little lace this little tab was on the back of your your Air Jordan fives, and it's mainly on all your your Jordan um apparel and, and jerseys and things like that. It says quality products inspired by the greatest basketball player ever. You know, your insole is red and, and it has that little message right there. Let's pull out the uh, the shoe tree. Shoe tree, uh, standard shoe tree, size 11, 11 and a half. And uh, it come with white laces. They didn't come with any additional laces. And um, both shoes are the same. Only thing different on this shoe is on the back of this tongue right here. It says soul and on the back of the other tongue it says heart so i'm guessing unc is the heart and soul of, of where jordan comes from man what do y'all think looking at these man did y'all cop these you know did you think these was gonna sit put in the comments below let me know if you think the, if you thought these was gonna sit man let me know if you was able to hit your pair let me know if you passed on these if you waiting for something else you know and I always remember, tomorrow is not promised, so take advantage of today. Until next time, it's Legit Sully. I'm out of here.